Today in the Secret Lab, we'll explore the morbid side of microelectronics, mixing Victorian metaphysics with modern gadgetry. Whether you're a fan of the Davenport brothers or James Randi, we've got you covered. The instructions are simple. Imagine, if you will, the object of your disdain. And ask only, what will be their final disposition? This is the perfect gift for your extra gothy BFF, but what is inside this enigmatic ebony edifice? Not much, really. It's got an LCD screen, an Arduino Nano, a 3.7 volt lithium battery, and three mercury tilt switches. I wanted the main power to go through a tilt switch, so there would be no quiescent current while the tragic fate ball isn't in use. There's no reason to waste battery when you're just waiting for a victim, I mean audience. I initially tried some ball bearing tilt switches that I had left over from another project. But they were so jittery, even with three of them in parallel, any slight motion would cut the power. All three would frequently lose contact at the same time. To get consistent power, I used mercury tilt switches. Each one points a different direction in a helix around the sphere's equator, so no sideways motion can cut the power. For the shell, I drew up plans in OpenSCAD, and wrote a script for turning images into OpenSCAD commands to generate the skull and crossbones shape from a PNG. The shell has a couple of holes in it under the inserts, so you can inject hot glue from the inside when affixing the inserts, and adjust their depth so they line up smoothly with the outer surface of the sphere, or push something up inside while any kind of glue is curing for the same purpose. This was a fun project, and it came together really quickly once the components arrived. So I think I could actually recommend making your own tragic fate ball if you like. Unlike my puzzle cube chandelier, which might be more trouble than it's worth. The 3D print files and Arduino sketch are in the description. I hope you saw something you liked, and what tragic fate do you think should be added to the list? <laughs>